Crypto Lightsaber back with another video guys. We're going to talk about Drip Network and the Animal Farm and more specifically my strategy going into the Drip Garden. Alright guys, I'm not new to the Drip Garden. I initially went in with about $15,000 when it first launched. In fact, it wasn't when it first launched. I waited. I didn't go in on the first day, which was my mistake. And I actually went in, you know, while the balances were falling, you know, and, um, you know, basically... Um, you know, I'm, I probably went in somewhere over here, all right, guys. So, um, over time, I have experienced a decay, and um, yeah, the way that this thing is built, it incentivizes you to come in, come back in later, all right, guys. So, if you miss the beginning, you're probably getting a better rate um, as time goes by, um, in terms of the uh, seed value and the plants that you're going to get for your LP tokens, which I'll um, just elaborate on in a short while okay but i do recommend you come and check this out and then you'll be able to understand how this all works all right guys but yeah i have been averaging into the drip garden uh one of the main reasons is i heard through the grapevine because i don't listen to the forex sharks amas too much anymore <laughs> you know i've kind of got bored of them but um you know yeah because forex shark does talk for a long time so i normally check out drip influencers with their with you know the updates on the key points relating to the AMAs and stuff like that and more specifically the relaunch date of the animal farm which I'm expecting now or I've heard that is going to be at the beginning of October someone said October the 4th I don't know if that's the actual date however uh, I think that you know right now is a good time if it is going to be launching in October relaunching in October I think it's a good time to be preparing way ahead all right guys so a month in advance because when the animal farm comes back on there's going to be a little bit of FOMO. It has a big community. I believe the drip, uh, the, the drip price is going to increase. Okay, the drip price right now is going down again, unfortunately, down to $6.92 from about, uh, it was up over $10 not too long ago. All right, guys, so the drip price is going down, which means my balance in the drip garden has fallen even just over the last couple of hours. It was up over $5,200. Now it's down under five thousand dollars, and um, yeah, um, I do believe that this is going to increase though. So, my aim is to grow with the contract. So, we'll take another look at that in a minute. But, um, I believe that over the course of this month is going to probably be the best time to accumulate into the drip garden, and um, you know, a lot more people will jump into this over time, especially when the animal farm comes back. On. Not only that, it gives you time to accumulate Drip BUSD LP tokens, which you can also use in the farm, in the animal farm when it goes live. And, uh, and when it goes live, I think a lot of people are going to be buying Drip BUSD tokens um, or pairing up their Drip at least and um, using them in the farm, in the animal farm to earn additional yield on these Drip BUSD tokens. So they are pretty sought after and probably will be when it goes back live, right? Um, even in the drip garden alone, over the last uh, couple of hours, you know, maybe two to four to six hours, it has gone up by another 200 LP tokens. And each day this is rising by the looks of it. Um, just under 470,000 total LP tokens locked. All right, guys. So uh, as you can see, I have 1.595, just under 1.6 million plants which is paying a decent 3% return on the investment every day. Um, if we go to drip.formulate.finance, again, you can see I have just under $5,000 in here. This has gone down from this morning. It was about $172 daily return uh, in USD. Um, now it's down to about 165.73 a day. 17.62 LP tokens, 53,181 plants, and um, obviously increasing, you know, as I compound and add more in um, dollar cost average back into this uh, particular uh, miner or ecosystem, right? So um, if you don't know how this works, right? Coming in now, is pro you're probably getting a better deal than if you would have came in over here because I actually bought in over here, not on the very first day, which was my mistake. Um, I can't remember how long it was into the contract when I actually did buy, but I bought in with a quite a hefty bag, $15,000. I had been withdrawing, claiming, compounding, doing all of that sort of stuff. But over time, okay, I have experienced decay. 
All right, guys, so I'm nowhere near the 15,000, the original 15,000 I put in. I didn't completely understand the model um, altogether when I aped. And, um, you know, story of my life, you know, I've aped into a lot of things. And, um, you know, if I would have researched it, looked at the model a little bit more carefully, I probably would have, you know, spent that 15K a little bit more wisely going into the minor. Maybe would have averaged in 5K, weighted a couple of weeks and did 5k and waited maybe a couple of weeks couple of months and did another 5k but that's just not the way it went but right now um i've managed to get quite a lot of tokens for a fraction or a third of the price by the looks of it um just by waiting all right guys and just waiting it out so the fact that the animal farm has been shut down that's given us another opportunity to be able to average into the drip garden and when it turns back on and the marketing starts, it's like getting into a whole new project all over again. And that's the way it was designed, okay, to incentivize people coming in at a later date. So you don't just look at it and think, you know what, the miner's dead, there's no point coming in. Actually coming in now, you're going to get a much better rate and a lot more plants than what you would have as if you would have came in a week ago, two weeks ago, a month ago, two, three months ago, right, for example, right? So... Yeah, I mean, go and check it out, of course. I'm, I'm probably not explained it the best. Uh, but yeah, go and check out, you know, read through the details if you're going to go into the drip garden. There is a referral link. I've not earned many referrals throughout this whole thing. All right, guys, I will leave a referral for you if you want to get into the drip garden. And like I said, you know, what we're doing is anticipating the price of the plants, uh, the price of the LP token, so the drip BUSD LP tokens increasing, and the contract this increasing in the build up to the animal farm relaunch date. And then when the relaunch happens, then another little you know FOMO kind of into this, and, and we see this contract go nuts potentially. Right? Does it have to happen? That's just what I'm anticipating, that's what I'm planning. Okay, guys, the bear market normally provides opportunities, all right, guys? And it's about seizing opportunities in the bear market. You don't always win, you don't always get it right. But uh, if you don't take a shot, you will never hit, all right, guys? So that should be a lesson to you. But um, yeah, I mean, you can use this website to check out your statistics and so on. It's drip.formulate.finance. Uh, basically, if you pay about $5 or 0.025 BNB, uh, you get the premium, so you'll be able to see all of this information. If you don't pay that, it's just a donation that you pay to the um, developer, right? And basically, the contract reads that you've sent that, and it basically um, gives your uh, gives your wallet premium access to the whole site. So you, you can actually check out, you know, your piggy bank, your drip, force it. So you can actually play around with that. And, um, you know, just uh, paste your wallet address in and it will basically bring up all of your statistics. All right, guys. But me, I'm focused on building the drip garden. I've already got a decent drip position. I've got two drip accounts, which are sitting. They, they're in a decent position at the moment. Not as high as I'd like them to be. But, um, you know, if the price of drip comes down a lot further, I'll just do the same. I'll just DCA more into drip. Um, I've got stable sitting on the side, you know, ready to, you know, do whatever. Um, you know, in the bear market, of course, um, stack up on some blue chips, increase my drip position and all that sort of thing. So, you know, it's always good to prepare in a bear market because the, the bear market is not always going to be bearish, right? It's going to turn bullish somewhere along the line. All right, guys, to get into the drip liberation, to, sorry, to get into the piggy bank, you can actually use the drip liberation contract, which takes you to the old animal farm DAP. And basically, you can just zap in with BUSD and you can bypass the fees that you normally pay on drip, for example, uh, the 10% uh, tax. And um, that will basically zap you into your LP tokens. You can then bring your LP tokens over to the drip garden. All right, guys, and then you can just basically, um, you basically uh, enter the amount over here. Let's say you've got 100 LP tokens and you buy your plants and then you, they, you're you good to go. You're in the drip garden, right? Uh, you can see the amount of uh, seeds available or your payout um, right here. As you can see, I've got 10.011 LP tokens, $94, which you can claim or comp, uh, you can, sorry, you can compound or claim 
okay and that goes rolls back into the contract if you can't compound right and then obviously you build up your position and you'll see that you've got a lot more plants than what you had um, or you can claim all right guys and then what you do is you go over to pancake swap and withdraw or remove lp and then withdraw back into drip and into busd and do whatever you do all right guys everyone's going to have their own strategy um if you are going to be claiming every day right that's just going to affect uh, your um it's going to affect the type of payout that you can get or the sustainability of your three percent a day for example and um you know it's, it's good to be compounding and claiming you know there's nothing wrong with claiming some people like to just compound 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 in anticipation for uh you know the, the future uh some people will compound five days claim two days compound six days claim one day you know i'm not here to give you any sort of strategy like that right the main uh, reason for this video is basically to strategize actually building a position into it in anticipation for the launch of the animal farm, the relaunch of the animal farm uh, sometime in about a month's time. So rich or wrecked, right? We don't know. I could just get it wrong and we could just see a lot more decay. My balance is just tumble and um, this doesn't pump. Uh, uh, the, the drip garden doesn't go nuts when the animal farm launches. I don't know. But no risk, no reward. All right, guys. I believe that we're going to see a lot more videos coming out on it. Uh, a lot of people, you know, a, a lot of times at the beginning, you get the hype. And then in the middle, people forget about it. And then all of a sudden, things come roaring back again. We saw it with the drip price. We, uh, we've seen it with the animal farm price, uh, that, that the animal farm pigs token price. Uh, we saw it with BR34P, another 4 it shark token. Um, so yeah, I mean these things happen, but I think that you know this can come roaring back, and uh, there's going to be a lot more videos coming out once this goes live, right? Once once the Animal Farm relaunches, all the influencers that normally talk about drip, the Animal Farm, they've been quiet for a long time, but they're all going to jump back on it. They're all going to start talking about the Animal Farm, uh, the LP farms, uh, in, uh, including the Animal Farm, Drip Garden piggy bank all that sort of stuff all right guys but yeah drip garden um is where i'm building a position rather than piggy bank at the moment uh but i just prefer it okay and i like this whole um uh you know this this whole model um you know you're getting more bang for your buck right now okay guys so i just wanted to put that on your radar if it wasn't on your radar already link is in the description do me a favor, subscribe to the channel, tick the little bell for notifications, let me know what you think in the comments. Uh, none of this is financial advice, I'm only showing you what I'm doing, don't risk more than what you can afford to lose, and I'll see you guys in the next video.